open yours. And she's like, I open yours too, because I was Oh, Pop that little bottle. My life is a literal roller coaster. Yeah, I don't want you recording. I don't want my bag. Ah. Wait, don't tell me to hold on. No, so you would know. I, I wouldn't know how to shoot. <laughs> Kids. Kids, everybody say hi. Good morning, y'all. Happy Sunday. Yes, I said Sunday. Welcome to a new vlog. A new week. A new work week in my life vlog. Yes, it's Sunday, girl. They got your girl working overtime on a Sunday. So, I have to go in because we got, I guess, a lot of people coming in for orientations to fill out applications to get hired. Just a lot of fun stuff. Yeah. So, um... They got me up early on this mother freaking Sunday. It is 10.02. I got to be there at 11. So we're going to go to Starbucks first and get a hot chocolate. To my satisfaction. Okay. So yeah, we're going to go to Starbucks first to get a hot chocolate. Fun fact, I only get hot chocolates from Starbucks. Like, that's all I drink. I don't. I tried um, chai latte, like the pumpkin spice chai latte. But it just tastes like eggnog to me. So I'm like, if I want eggnog. I'll just go buy some egg notes. Like, I don't... I'd be there at 11, but they said that we should be getting off at 4. Or, like, around 4. So, that's cool. It's not 8 hours straight. I'll take it. <laughs> there go that lady. So, y'all... <clears throat> I went to... Wait. Here go the lady right here. Let me see if she's going to say something to me. No. Um, okay, the lighting is bad, so I'm just gonna talk fast. But the craziest thing is, I went in and on the little name thing, right? Bam, it says Sean. And when I went in, I had grabbed one and said Sean, but it just said Sean and said latte. And I was like, okay, so I opened it, I looked in it, and it looked like hot milk. And I was like, okay, so I was like, excuse me, um, I'm like, I don't know what came through on the app because I did like an online order. I was like, but I, um, put hot chocolate, but it says latte, like, I don't know. And then it was this lady next to me, she's like, oh, that's mine, my name is Sean too. And I'm like, what it's like an old old white lady she right here y'all she leaving um and i was like oh so she had mine in her hand and i had hers in my hand so then i was like oh my god well, i opened yours and she's like i opened yours too because i was trying to see why it said hot chocolate and i was like and i was trying to see why mine said latte that's hella funny so it was spelled the exact same way and everything so um she was like nice to meet you i've never met like another sean you know and i was like oh cool like me either actually especially well i, I mean i've heard of him but i never like really met another woman named sean like face to face type shit without their name being something else like Shauna or Roshan, something like that, you know? She said her name is just Shauna, and I'm like, mine's is too, lady, so that's hella crazy. That was just hella awkward. That was hella, what is it called, coincidental. But we swapped drinks, and then I left, and she, and then I came around here to the park to get, like, good lighting or better lighting, and I parked right next to her car, I didn't even know, so she came walking over here smiling like, bye. So, all right, y'all, we good. Now we head into the job. We got 30 minutes. I'm not gonna lie. I'm vibing out to R. Kelly. I will never stop listening to. I will. I will never stop listening to R. Kelly music. Like I just won't. Like I just. I just can't. I, I, like his music still hits. Okay, it just hit for me. Okay. So um, I should do this. No. No. Look at me on Instacart trying to go fucking Instacart. Like no, no, no. Take your ass to work for you be late. Like what the fuck. So, okay, I'm finna turn my music back on. I just want to let y'all know that we secured the Starbies and we met another little woman named Sean. And now we head into work. What's up, y'all? I am off heading home. It is 4 o'clock. And, um, yeah, we was there for hella long for literally nothing. We had three fucking people come in. Which means, like, one person could have handled those three people. And literally, we could have did it from home. Like, it never had to be... <sighs> Hold on. Hey, I'm at Starbucks. Um, I want to try something different. I always get hot chocolate. Let's do... I mean, not nothing with no coffee. Though. I got ice. Oh, that's the gingerbread oat milk. Should I try that one? The gingerbread oat milk. Can I do the um, ice gingerbread oat milk chai latte? 
A small? Yeah, can I have extra gingerbread? Wait, what's the gingerbread? Is it syrup or is it sprinkles? Like, um, it depends. So if it's ice, it's gonna be the syrup in the foam. It comes with like oat milk foam, uh -huh. and then we put the gingerbread in the foam, and then for the drink itself, it's just a chai. Oh, that's why I didn't taste it. Okay. For a hot one. What's the um? For a hot one, it's the gingerbread syrup and the chai together in the whole drink. Okay. Um. What's the sprinkles on top? Is that like a spice? It's pumpkin. It's like pumpkin spice popping. Okay. Um, so can I add gingerbread syrup in the drink? Yeah, for the ice one? Yeah, for the ice one. Okay, so ice gingerbread, I'll try. You want the gingerbread foam and the gingerbread in the drink? Yeah, can I get two pumps of gingerbread syrup? Yeah. It's good, thank you. Six fifty-five. Okay. What's up, y'all? I'm on my way to work. It's 9.49. I gotta be there at 10, but I'm like three minutes away, so I'm good. I'm to be at work at 10, and I'm looking like, I'm looking so professional today. Well, okay, probably not from the top, but like from the bottom, I'm looking real professional because I didn't have no more jeans. I'm gonna show y'all when I get out, because y'all probably can't see. I had no more jeans clean. I put them in the washing machine this morning, thinking like, oh, I could like wash and dry my jeans and then put them on before I leave, but baby, no. I was running late, so I had to go get like my professional pants because... You know, I'm hiring people and shit. I don't want to be look, like having no fucking leggings or sweatpants on, looking like, you know, hey, do you want to work here? Like, bitch, you don't look professional. So, that's what we're doing now. Um, I'm getting my gingerbread chai oat milk latte, okay? Yeah, can I have one, please? Oh, so cute, little. Thank you. You too. Uh oh. But this is how it looks, girl. Let me taste it. I got a straw just in case, but. I can tell already, like, it's hella dark at the bottom and it's hella light at the top, so let's try to mix it. Oh, yeah. Bro. It still tastes like, oh, I mean, maybe that's just the taste of chai. It tastes like fucking eggnog to me. Like, it always tastes like eggnog. Want to see? Mm-hmm. It just tastes like eggnog. I don't know. Maybe this is just not my thing. But, Okay. I guess that's cool. Boy, don't tell me to hold on. And you hold on to that big ass truck. I'm talking about wait, wait, wait. No, you wait, wait, wait for me, motherfucker. All right, y'all, I'm at work. Oh, let me show y'all real quick. Okay, y'all, this is my professional look. Let me go, because I'm late and there's hella people sitting outside. I know they waiting on me. So I have to go outside. What's up, y'all? I am basically off work at this point. I did my little orientations. I did the um, paperwork part of everything. And I'm back home because I'm just like, I need to go like Thanksgiving shopping. So I need to get um, all my ingredients that I'm I'm cooking macaroni and cheese. I think I'm cooking greens. Mother's making dressing and turkey and ham. And I just figured we need to cook on Wednesday night. Like, let's cook Wednesday night. So then Thursday, the day of Thanksgiving, we can just, like, heat pans up and everybody could just eat. Instead of we're trying to cook and wait on the food to be done because we never eat till hella late. So, that's what we finna do. I came home because I want to get my kids. They've been in the house for a while. I need to take them. I want to take them with me. Just working, 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 working. Like, I literally worked every day last week. Monday through Friday. Then I was off Saturday, but I worked Sunday. Today, back to Monday, working again. I hate when I feel like the job is, like, consuming me. You know, like, my life is revolving around the job. Like, uh, no, mm -mm, they don't work like that. You, this job is going to revolve around me and my, my time and what I got going on. So, today we're going to do some Thanksgiving shopping. I want to take my kids out. I'm going to take them out with me to the grocery store, but I also want to take them, like, out to do something. Maybe to park, something, something to just to get out and, like, run some energy out. Tomorrow is Tuesday. So, tomorrow London got a doctor appointment to get a cast on her. She actually broke her fucking thumb. Part right here, when you bend your thumb, that little part, it's like the bone right there. He said it's, like, fractured or whatever. So, I guess you need a cast. So, tomorrow we go to the actual department, because we was in emergency. So, we go to the actual department that fixed bones i don't know what it's called oncology or whatever but and it's crazy because it's the thumb that she sucks so it's kind of like is that god telling you to stop sucking your thumb because you do got a dentist appointment coming up too it got smashed in the fucking door at school y'all so it's fucking 
broke right there so that's tomorrow so in the morning i do have a meeting to get on for my job but i'm gonna do that from home because we could work from home sometimes so i'm gonna get on the meeting in the morning from home because right after the meetings, then I have to take her to the doctor to go get her cast. So that we got Wednesday, and Wednesday is the day I need to cook. But I'm going to still go to work. I'm going to go to work that day, and then when I come home, I can cook. You know, because I could cook all night. I don't, it don't have to be no specific time. Thursday, we fucking off, finally, thank God. It'll be cool. I'm a, We're going to be chilling at my grandma's house for Thanksgiving, family-oriented. Everybody going to be there, kids, everything. And then Friday is back to work. They say that we are not off Friday, y'all, so... Like, that's just like the layout y'all i'm just you know giving y'all the vibes letting y'all know what's going on over here hey vlog remember i told y'all next time y'all see me i'm gonna have the kids and do but we're not doing the thanksgiving shopping that i thought we was gonna do we are at the emergency again the emergency y'all two times in one week is crazy because last week i came from london when she broke her thumb so now we here because party he been like they all been well not all Car cash and cardi been having like this little sickness with like the congestion and the mucus in their chest and the snotty nose and stuff like that but today when i and see look i got my this this the mama instinct the mama instincts this is the motherly instincts for real because i was i was at work and i was done with all my stuff and my coworker had called me and told me like, you know, I could, if I'm done, I could come help her. And I'm just like, mm, nah, because I still been trying to like do shit with my kids. Like I ain't been having enough time to like, you know, t I haven't been having time on my hands to really like enjoy some time with my kids. And like they out for a week, I need to go grocery shopping for Thanksgiving and stuff like that. So I was just like, no. And I, my, my whole plan was to go home, go get my kids, and then go grocery shopping. So I go home, and I'm getting them together, and I was getting um, Cardi together. And I had his, I had his face by my ear because I was holding him. And I'm like, why is it like you wheezing? So it's like, he got that cough, that hard-ass cough, and I could hear him, like, like wheezing, basically. Not like a whistle, but just like a, like a hard breathe in, breathe out. So I called the advice nurse and I was trying to make it a doctor appointment, but they don't have no doctor appointments available. So she told me to go to emergency. So that's what we're here for. I will see y'all after we get out the emergency because I'm not going to bring my camera in because I need to hold my baby. So, <laughs> All right, y'all. We back in the car. We just got the doctors. It's 2.30, so that wasn't too long. Um, and they said that he got, it's called bronchitis, bronchitis bronchitis he said that i mean the doctor it was a man he said that it's called bronchial bronchiolitis but it was basically from rsv said that everything sounds fine he don't need no treatment he don't need x-rays he don't need nothing like further investigating about it because he's like 100 percent sure he gave me this Mind you, I've been needing one of these. He used to have one of these. But I threw it away because he was a baby baby, you know? And we I never used it again. But now, I need it. We used that for him to sleep by the humidifier, which I already bought a humidifier the other day. And he, we've been using it, so. But, yeah. Pretty sure, more than likely, it came from Cash. Because Cash, the one I've been going to school. And then his little kids at school, they've been having these calls. Runny nose, da-da-da. So, when Cash came home, he had that. And then him having that been on a baby the whole time, now the baby got it. So yeah, it's just like, it's being passed around at this point. But he said that right now we, this is like his fourth day having it. He said it was like smack dab in the middle because between three and five days is when it's the worst. And then after the fifth day, it starts to get better. So see why I brought him in. Cause he's like, yeah, I know you probably was thinking like, you know, it's starting to get worse. I don't seem like it's clearing up, but he said it's gonna clear up after this. So hopefully next week sometime, I'm tired of seeing hospitals, but now we are going to go, I guess we could go Thanksgiving shopping. Do I feel like it? No, now I really don't, but I still need to. Oh. Your boyfriend looks like a broken Y'all, look, look, look at my baby. Look at my baby. Look at my baby face. Hey, guys. Hey, guys, we, we, we at the park. We is not no park. Stop lying. We are safe for you. Baby, come on, come on. Stop cashmere sound. Alright, y'all. We are safe for you. I know I said I know I said we was coming to Safeway to get some Thanksgiving food, but baby. I just took an order for Instacart, so 
we gonna come back later for the Thanksgiving food, but for right now, we about to go pick up this $30 order and go drop it off real quick. Cause, yeah, no money comes first. Money comes first, money comes first. And you better get it while it's here, cause if you don't get it while it's here, you ain't gonna catch nothing. But I only got a um, pick up and go order, so. Look like for the pick up and go orders. So it's gonna tell you on your phone, but this is where you pick up from A, B, C, and all of these. You go like this, bam, on your phone. There we go. And then I got three people, bam, you're gonna press start pickup. And then it'll tell you like D2, D2, D2. Cool. So you're gonna go to shelf D, number two, and look for the name F U R E, F U R E, bam. And then you scan it. And that's one. That's two. That's one, two. You scan it. Cool. Bam. Now say three or three. Cool. Done. And you're gonna go to. Uh, it's trying to think I'm gonna scan it. Then you go to next. Bam. Pick up the next people, okay? That's all three orders. No, get over here. And some stuff down here. Oh yeah, you stay right And now we're going to deliver. So it'll tell you, like, you know, start delivery. She got a lot of instructions. Look at all these damn instructions she got. Um, but we on our way there. Leave him alone. All right, y'all. This is my first delivery. I'm literally right here at this place. I'm looking for the lady who's supposed to be. She told me for me to wait. I'm not waiting, so. All right, y'all, we all know where to deliver number two, order number two. All right, y'all, we delivering a second order. Let's see, she right here. Holy my mom make turkey and ham. My mom, I'm not even gonna kill with y'all, but my mom macaroni, ooh, I be, ooh, I, one time I almost, me and Nia, one time me and Nia, my cousin, we almost sat there and ate the whole pot. Water falling. Uh. Uh. All right, y'all. Can we hear something? Let's done with that. Can we, we got hear? one more person, and then after that, we hit him back up to Safeway. I ain't gonna lie, if it keep being busy with um, delivery onlys or um, just orders, period, like, oh, it's not, uh-uh, let me have to move. Being busy, I'm gonna keep taking them because why not make some extra money? I can make my gas money back today that I spent, my fast food money kidding? back today that I spent. All right, y'all, we at the last stop. The sun is just dead smacking my face. Um, We at the last delivery. This is their house right here, so I'm gonna go to the back, get their bag, and deliver it, and then go back to safe. And then we're done. Yeah, let me record this way so they can see me. Cause I gotta walk over. They seen all they seen was not food. Yeah. Yeah. Oh yeah, say Broadway busy too. Still. All right, y'all. Alright y'all, we are meeting my daddy. We helping him push my grandma's car back home because my grandma's car don't start back up no more. So, yeah, we on, we on his bumper. About to push him. <laughs> what, Dada? Mom, I'm here. I'm seeing that. You should have stopped so I could go right back behind you. Yeah, 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 now you wanna <laughs> <laughs>
Bump you real quick. Get, this thing is gonna turn and just keep going. Around, go around, go around. Thank you. Mm. You should never even pull in front of them like that. Uh come on, come on. Bro, I'm scared right now, y'all. Come on, come on. Come on, come on. Uh -uh. Mom, um, yo, look at under my thing. What the fuck is on? Oh, it's like cotton. We back at Safeway and I'm about to go in and go shopping. I'm not gonna record that part. I'm just gonna record when I get home and show y'all what we get because it's gonna be too hectic. It's hella people in here. I got these kids with me. I gotta find a cart. Um, just wait. Just gonna be hectic. I can already see the parking lot is full, so I know it's a hundred thousand people up in here. Okay, 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 okay. That's a little better. Did it help you? I hear it in your throat though. You gotta cough that shit. <laughs> See, I hear it all in there. Maybe you can do some uh some warm water and honey, that's what we told you, told you. Oh yeah, Marvin, yesterday we pushed Mimi car on my back. Oh yeah, we recorded it too. I don't know what the fuck this camera is doing, but y'all, we just leaving at the house. And it's 11.26. <clears throat> Lennon got an appointment at 11.30 to get her cast on her thumb. So, that's what we on our way to. We only live like five minutes from the hospital, but still... We're still gonna be late. Um, because I still gotta find parking and we still gotta get in. But yesterday I told y'all I took my baby to the hospital or whatever. And remember I told y'all they said it was like bronchi bronchiolitis. So I looked up bronchiolitis and it's basically from RSV. The the man was telling me that too, but I didn't know I knew RSV was like um like a condition that that like mess with your lungs or whatever, like it make your heart pain to breathe and stuff like that. But he was like, Yeah, it was from um it stems from RSV. That's where bronchiolitis come from. And the bad, the worst days is days three through five. And these are the days three through five. This is the fifth day that he didn't have it. So he just like, oh, it was hard for him to sleep last night. He was breathing hella hard last night. So I stayed up hella long watching him. And um, then when he finally do go to sleep, it's like he's so stuffy. So he got to stay up. Like I'm irritated with that. So I'm not at work because my baby ain't feeling good and I'm not about to just up and leave to go to work and I'm not sure you know he not feeling the best he literally just been waking up just crying crying he just sitting in the house crying crying ain't even nothing wrong he just crying and he ain't even like that so I know that he just ain't feeling good I'm gonna try um warm water and honey today because I thought he couldn't drink honey because of some type of bacteria but the doctor said that if they over one they could do it so we're gonna do a teaspoon of honey and some warm water and maybe that'll help like the cough and that'll help break up some of that mucus. Oh, yeah. <sighs> Bitch, if you make me miss this like It's like when you always in a rush, it's all these dumb motherfucking drivers that we thought should be in front of you. Now we all stopping because somebody wanna let somebody cross the street. It's just always something. Hey Siri, order my regular from Starbucks. That's cold as fuck. Good morning. Good morning to you. The birds are charming. Remember that, y'all? Y'all, good morning. It's 8:35. It is. Make sure nobody in this car. It's um Wednesday, the day before Thanksgiving. I don't know where we left off yesterday, but hey, I had a lot going on. I washed my hair, so it's curly as wet right now. So I'm trying to. Had this on my neck so it's not touching me. Um, I don't know where we left off yesterday, but I was not able to find no damn macaroni shells because they all gone because Thanksgiving tomorrow and everybody making macaroni and cheese, so that was a given. But I was able to find them at a Target, so I did a pick up and go order for 
three boxes of shells. I don't want to get too much because I want to leave some for other people, you know. I'm only making two pans, so I probably only need two boxes, but I'm going to keep a box too because sometime during next month, I might want to make some macaroni and cheese again. Yeah, that's a plus. So, what happened yesterday? Hmm, I don't even know what we left off, but all I know is my baby wasn't feeling good. I went to work for... Oh, I went to work. I probably didn't even tell y'all that. So, I went to work. I went to work late. I got there at like 12.30 and I stayed till like 7, like 6.37. Yeah, I helped file paperwork. I helped get everything in order because if you don't... If you don't stay on top of your papers, like that shit start piling up too quick. I ain't gonna tell y'all how Safeway was booming. I mean, like people just walking in with an empty purse walking out with a full fucking purse and i'm like hmm like two people we saw do that then we saw a bum come in and get um watermelon and walk out i'm like so why am i paying for shit I'm like the fuck why do i gotta pay for shit y'all motherfuckers just taking it but that's a different story for a different day for now it is wednesday morning and i think i told y'all like i'm not i'm not gonna ever cancel r kelly music like I'm not saying what he did was right, no. But I'm saying his music, his music, he got hits. Like, you think I'm finna not listen to R. Kelly because, no, not happening. So, with that being said, I've been jamming to R. Kelly all fucking week. Every time I do my paperwork, I'm like, hmm, I want to hear R. Kelly. So, I've been listening to like a little R. Kelly mix or whatever. But, right now, I'm, I'm about to be on my way to work. They called me, they wanted me to be there at 10 now they want me to be there at nine so i'm gonna be there close to nine but not exactly at nine because i gotta go get a starbucks drink i'm at a whole different location today because they needed help somewhere else so yeah i always see my neighbor i think she work overnight like a nurse or something she has to because i always see her oh I, I i think i know something okay so yesterday we went to go get london's her cast for her thumb right we get in there I was recording on my phone, like, because I want to record. I'm not recording you. I'm recording my daughter and what you're doing to her fucking hand, like, or her fucking thumb. And then she pulled up the x-ray, so I, p I put my phone up high up because I'm trying to, like, see the x-ray. And she spazzed the fuck out, like, are you are you recording? Are you recording? You can't record. Da -da -da. First, I said, first of all, who are you talking to? Who are you talking to? So she, like, um, yeah, I don't want you recording. I don't want my badge. I don't want you to record my badge or some shit she said. And I said, and if I am, like, if I am recording, like, what you gonna do? You're not taking my phone from me, so the fuck? So she like, um, yeah, you can record. If you want a picture of the extra, I can take a picture. Let me see your phone. I can take a picture. I can take a picture. And then I turned around and was like, were, were you really recording? Like, were you recording? Yeah, that was that. So after, after that happened and she looked at the x-ray, she went to go get London just like a little plastic splint and was like, yeah, you could just keep this on for, keep this on for like three weeks. Um, I'll follow up with you guys in like three weeks. This'll work. This'll work thought she was getting a cast what happened to a cast no she don't need a cast she doesn't need it like so i feel like she felt offended by me recording and she just was trying to hurry up and get me out of there at that point so you know what i did <laughs> i called yesterday and i'm like yeah i told i didn't tell them what happened i was like yeah we was coming in to go get a splint i mean we was coming in to get a cast for my daughter thumb today and the doctor lady gave her a little plastic splint and the splint is not staying on it's hella big so we have to tape it like tape it closed to make it kind of stay but I don't know how well that's going to do on her fucking thumb if it's just going to slide on and off type shit, you know? So, I, yeah, I called and I told him that. And I'm like, yeah, I want something more permanent. I don't want this little plastic ass splint. I want something permanent. Something that she can't slide on and off or can't take on and off. I want her thumb to heal correctly. So, they like, okay, call to... They told me today to call the department that I went to yesterday. I think it's called oncology or something. I don't know. But they told me to call that department today and tell them what happened like about the plastic splint situation and that uh, we want something more permanent because she's only eight years old she has to go to school next week i don't want that shit slipping on and off she can't play at, P at pe the lady saw that she can't play at pe like just put something more more permanent on there that's not going to slip on and off that's all i'm saying so so yeah i remember that that's what happened maybe that's what made me like you know what bitch i'm not i'm, I'm not even enough. i mean not that she ruined my mood but she kind of ruined my mood, like. Hmm. It's hitting for something. Oh. I needed this. So refreshing. I'm lying, it's not refreshing, but. 
it's good though Whew. all right y'all we secured the starbies now we are on our way to work it's 8 47 so yeah i will not be there at no nine o'clock i will be there like 9 15 which should be cool because given that i was only aware of what time i was supposed to be there like an hour ago that's pretty good that's pretty good that i was able to still get up get in the shower get dressed do my hair get my starbucks and get my ass to work in an hour like that's good real reasonable real reasonable if you ask me so all right y'all i'm at work it is 9 11 but i'm about to get out because it's already people standing outside so i guess they waiting for orientation <clears throat> so maybe they was waiting on me i don't know but i'm finna see they all right here Hello, somebody else driving up uh okay well so i'll check in with y'all when i leave oh my god my life is a roller coaster y'all my life is a roller coaster my life is a literal literal roller coaster so it is 11 09 i'm like technically off work but not off work because i'm going to another building to go help oh uh, so y'all the doctor just called me for my baby he got rsv or he had rsv now he got like it's called bronchitis bronchitis i know it's something called bronchitis but it's not bronchitis because in infants it's called like bronchitis or something like that so he has that so i'm gonna put it on the screen or matter of fact let me just show y'all this video of him sleep the other night and look how hard he was breathing y'all so i literally stayed up hell alone because i just kept like trying to watch him making sure he was cool um now my phone frozen like this is why I need a new phone. So, I stayed up for hella long, like, watching him keep my eye on him. I kept tossing, like, you know, making him toss and turn and stuff so he could move around. I woke up the next day. He was cool. He's he's hella congested. Chest all congested. Got all that mucus in his chest. All his, no, his nose hella congested. Got all that mucus in the back of his throat, all in the back of his nose. Um, the breathing was hella hard. Then he had a fever yesterday. So, I'm just like, okay, this shit is getting worse. So, I called the doctor. They just called me back, and they made him an appointment for today at 4.30. So, it's 11. Now, it's 11.11. So, make a wish. So, now it's 11.11. And, like, I got to go to another building. But, I'm going to be leaving before 4. Because I got to take my baby to the doctor. Like, that, there's no ifs, ands, or buts about that. I'm taking him to the doctor. Um, just to make sure he's okay. And Because I told the doctor, I don't feel like it's getting better. I feel like it's getting worse. Because now he got a fever. First, he didn't have a fever. Now, he got a fever. So, yeah no um now i'm about to go to this other building and go help out for a couple hours and then after that i am going home getting him ready to take him to the doctor and then i kind of want to take my kids out again it's it's the day before thanksgiving i know i need to cook and stuff but it's kind of like they've been in the house like i know they've had been in the house like i could take them somewhere so i'll probably do that too and then i feel fulfilled and then i can go let me see if i can pick, make this rubber band I don't like my hair like this. I want it to be like, I want it to be more like this. Kind of like the clip effect type thing. Yeah, I'll feel more fulfilled if I take them to go do something just so I know they haven't just been sitting in the house for hella days in a row. And then after I take them to do something, I gotta come home, I gotta clean up. I gotta clean the dishes, wash the dishes. And I gotta go to my grandma's house and get this pot so I can make the greens. And then I can start prepping all my food. But that's gonna be a vibe. I'm gonna turn my music on. Yeah. Oh, another thing I want to do. Okay, so I'm about to do it right now. I'm about to do it right now on camera. Let's see. So this um YouTuber named Kaya that I be watching, right? Love her down. She was she been she always talk about the DH gate program. I hope I don't get whatever. She said that you're not supposed to say it out loud because you get like um flagged or something so what does she call it defense so we're gonna call it defense but it has said like it's easy to sign up da, 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 whatever so i signed up i used her link and i signed up so i did that hella long ago like maybe like two three months ago now i just got an email that's like hey i'm your where's that i'm your like manager accept into the program i'm your manager reach out to me if you need help or anything da, da, da. but like i don't know how legit that is I don't, I really don't even know how to, I really don't even know how to work the program for real, so, I was just gonna ask her, 
So I'm because I follow her on Instagram, so I'm just gonna be like, I'm gonna screenshot it and I'm gonna send it to her and I'm gonna just be like, first I'm gonna be like, hey girl, you know, I don't wanna just come off like, oh, what's this, da da da, you know? So I'm gonna be like, hey girl, I signed up for the DHG program, I mean the fence program because, you know, from you or whatever, and I just wanna know if this legit, like, you know, is it legit? Do you have a manager too, or is this somebody trying to scam me? I don't think there's too much of a scam they can do because, like, what you gonna do? take my commission or something like i'm not signing up for nothing with you but here it goes see like this is the email that they that she sent me i sent it to kaya we finna see right now i'm finna ask her like hey girl happy holidays you know i just wanted to know if this is legit because i signed up through the program with you for from you you know so you would know i, I wouldn't know how this should work i really don't even know how it work i'm finna ask her how it work as well because I, I really don't know how it work so we'll see if she replies we'll see um okay so right now we heading out we are going to this other office so see y'all when i get there um i've been listening to some r kelly <laughs> i've been on r kelly bad i've been on him heavy like i'd be like i haven't heard him in so long and it's just like he got all the hits i'm like y'all i'm in literally in hella traffic like that's annoying um but now change of plans i ain't going to work i'm not going to another location because she finna leave in a minute and she don't really need my help so cool let's keep it like that instead i'm gonna go get my kids from the house we're gonna go get food and then we're gonna go get nye my sister baby uh, from school i probably take them to go do something maybe i'll do that in that meantime and then take Cardi to his appointment. And then I could go home and get everything prepped and get everything started. Sound like a game plan, so let's do that. Okay. I, I, I desperately need a car mount, cause it's not gonna work. Came on here to tell y'all, look, we got a reply, girl. We got a reply. Hey, yes, that's how it works. They aren't really there for anything but help, that's it. It's nothing they can do to scam you. If so, then it's a scam. But, okay, cool, thank you cool i figured that because i'm like what can they really how can they really scam me you know like if i don't give y'all no information and if i'm not going through you to order shit i should be good so y'all if yes this is my time to tell y'all go check out the fence but it don't even trip don't even don't wait don't even go check out the fence shit let me order some shit and show y'all what i got and then y'all go check it out you know then y'all go order the shit that i got so i can get commissioned that's how it works so girl one thing about these kids they want to know every fucking move you make like oh if we gonna go do this then what we gonna go eat where we going what time we gonna what does it matter Just so anyway yeah i'm about to be pulling up at the house in a second and then um finna get the kids hi guys the... oh, hi guys say hello oh this is delicious mom i like this pizza but i like the pizza I want some pizza. Pizza? Yeah. Okay, can you get in your seat and sit back? Yeah. No, they didn't end up giving me a cat. They end up giving me this. Doing this. Yeah. Hey. Hello, guys. Hi, guys. What? We got big ones. Okay. Oh, 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 Our order has to get the noodles the pack just dropped my mom's spending her money on elbows i got elbows for her right now mm. two elbows okay y'all the battery's still gonna die but at least let me come on and do this a little bit okay so we got the noodles we got the Okay, get this 
Hey everybody, happy Thanksgiving. Today is Thanksgiving. Say happy Thanksgiving. Happy Thanksgiving. Thanksgiving. <laughs> happy Thanksgiving, y'all. So we're on our way to my grandma's house. I'll check in with y'all when we get there because it's too much going on. It's too loud. I can't set the camera down. So yeah, I'll just see y'all when we get there. Peace. We out fine. Say what's up? What's up? Say hi, wave. Wave, Cashy. All right, peace out. Jasir, oh my God, bro. I'm taking video. Hey guys. You say hi, Dika. Hi. Yeah, copyright, copyright, copyright. Hey, go London. Oh yeah, yeah, record me, record me. Hey guys. Follow my, wait, subscribe to my YouTube channel. It's Yo Girl Maya, 1023. Potato pie. She already did. We already made sweet Uh, Yeah, there you go. Yeah, right but there. that's your uncle birthday. Somebody eat half of it already. That's right. her uncle birthday. Yeah. Hey! Later! Oh, sorry. Hey, Mama. Cash. Hey, Mommy! <laughs> Say hello! them a bottle of champagne that's what London said it's called <laughs> look y'all champagne Mom, Mom, there you go. I want this my cup Mom. I feel it Mom, I can't get so I think my cup that's yours okay this morning Mom, watch out because it's been shaking. Oh, I was doing it. Oh, that's a cup party hey, I, 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 I
Hey, right there, what do you want to do today? I want to go home with my dad. Are you excited about the food? I did want it to eat. Say, me too, girl, me too. Wait, hey, what Marvin, you what do you want to do today? Huh? What do you want to, what is your favorite? Wait, what is the Hold thing on, you, you waiting for to do Hold today? up, Lightning. It's gonna fall on my head. What are you waiting for to do today? Hmm. I can't hold it. In. London. You, yes, you can. Oh, Let me okay. see. Get your cup. Let me get your cup. Good. Joshua, what are you waiting for to do today? What? What do you What do you want to do today? Today? Yeah. Hey, hey, um, okay? playing Marvin. Okay. I want um, to play basketball today. Do you want to eat? Are you ready Give to eat? Give me my cup. Yep. Okay. Wait. Marvin, what do you want to do today? Uh, I wanted to play basketball and see Parker as you want um, and Granny, and you want Are you excited for the food? Uh, yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah. Oh. Y'all see ready? Yeah. Okay, guys, I'm excited for the food too. So, ah, Kari, are you excited for the food? Wow, that was cool. Are you excited for the food? What? Thumbs up. You did one. Yeah. No way, you can't touch the food. Huh. Um, I'm what do you want to do today? Oh, yeah, yeah. yeah. Are you are you ready to eat? Yeah. Are you excited? Yeah. Okay, Jaden, what do you want to do today? No. I want to no. eat banana pudding. No. Okay, are you excited for the food? Yeah. Okay. Sip. No, no, I get spicy. No, I get your cup to the side. Yeah. I, I get this spicy. Y'all, here. Shut him! Shut him! Shut him! I get this spicy. Okay, so you have some more. Mom, your lens gonna break right here. That's because Cardi dropped it. Oh, it's delicious. It's delicious? Yeah. You got some? Hmm. Oh, yeah. 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 Oh, yeah.
one hand, holding hand. There we go. What about Joel? There we go. Be in the circles. Be quiet. Bow your hands. Close your eyes. Bow your hands. Close your eyes. Our Father who art in heaven, we thank you for this day. We thank you for when you was all up in this day. With no illnesses. I got caught. I hate it. And you thank you for this food that we have prepared for the nourishment of our bodies. And that we are going to enjoy this day together. Amen. 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 All this I pray in Christ's name. Amen. 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 I love God. More than all, y'all. Come on, y'all. Look at me and Maya's the dad. Wow. 